This is an Airbus A321 with 35 rows of seats holding almost 200 passengers. It usually takes about 20 minutes or more for them to board. However, in a trial just completed, 171 passengers boarded this plane in less than 13 minutes. How so? The answer is the flying carpet. It's simply the seating plan of the plane drawn to scale laid on the floor of the corridor leading to the plane. When the plane is ready for boarding, the entrance barrier is opened, allowing passengers to move forward onto the vinyl carpet and stand on or close to their seat numbers. Although they had no idea about the procedure until it was explained to them by the attendant, they were very quick to understand and find their places. As a result, they are now lined up in row order, rear seat passengers nearest the door of the plane, on the left at the end of the corridor. The barrier is now closed, while the other attendant at the exit end waves the group on to proceed to the plane. The first attendant explains the procedure to the next group and as soon as the first group has cleared the carpet, he opens the barrier again. Once again, the passengers walk forward and step onto their places. On average, it took about 35 seconds for the passengers to enter and line up and about 10 to 15 seconds for them to clear the carpet. The attendants regulated the groups so that the queue from the plane door back through to the air bridge was kept short. Overall, it took just over 10 minutes for 171 passengers in 9 or 10 groups to enter the plane. Within 13 minutes, they were all seated. Passengers were quick to understand and cooperated willingly. The key to the success in the system is that the usual bottlenecks in the plane just don't happen. Instead, passengers in each group are evenly spread along the aisle, readily able to stow their bags and get seated simultaneously. The flying carpet system was the first set of all methods we tested. 171 passengers in 30 minutes was a really good result for the first time. But with the benefit of experience, we got even better results. 151 passengers in 10 minutes. Passengers, especially young people and kids, were really enthusiastic and didn't need much explanation. But if the system became well known and passengers knew what to do and entrance, it would be much better probably less than 10 minutes for 180 passengers.